<sighs> What's up, YouTube? It's your boy Fina Pet, and this is the review for Batman and Robin. Boy, I'm. Yep. Here it goes. Thank you for watching this video. This is a review for Batman and Robin, directed by Joel Schumacher. Starring George Clooney as Batman slash Bruce Wayne, Chris O'Donnell as Dick Grayson slash Robin, Alicia Silverstone comes into the mix as Barbara, aka Batgirl, Michael Gold still return still in the films as Alfred, Pat Hingle, still Commissioner Gordon, but this time we have Arnold Schwarzenegger as Mr. Freeze and Uma Thurman as Poison Ivy. And I don't know who the heck was Bane. I don't know who that was. But Bane was in the film. Alright, basically, this is after the events of... This is not after the events. This is just a whole new story within the Schumacher series. I don't think Tim Burton knows exactly produ produced this one. But he uh, he wasn't with, with the series anymore after, after forever. So, basically, yeah. Mr. Freeze coming to the scene of Gotham, stealing diamonds or select, big diamonds, in regards to putting a cool weapon, to, a massive cool freezing weapon together. So, in order to, and also a side story that Pamela actually becomes Poison Ivy in this film, um, Batman and Robin tries to start freeze, but also has to deal with Poison Ivy and Bane. And then basically at the last day of the movie, Batgirl comes into come into the scene to help out. So basically, it's this good. The good about this film, film basically the toys, I guess. This was a massive toy commercial. It was. Massive toy commercial. Everything you saw, either it was the new Batmobile, Zeus of Batman and Robin the Batgirl, Bane, Poison Ivy, Mr. Freeze himself, Mr. Freeze's truck. All that was toys. Became toys that during the movies run not movies runtime, but movies out in theaters and stuff like that. Um, um, the backstory for Mr. Freeze. It was basically the backstory of Mr. Freeze. It's basically his backstory from Batman the Animated Series episode Heart of Ice. That was an excellent episode, episode of Batman the Animated Series. I, I recommend you watch that because that really gives Mr. Freeze a sympathetic villain role. I'm um, sorry, I'm doing my son right now. But overall, I give this film a 1 out of 5. This film sucks. George Clooney sucks as Batman. That's a problem. But yes, he, he was well known during the time for being an ER. But no, he should not have been Batman. Heck, Val Kilmer was a better Batman than George Clooney. And that's saying something. Uh, Chris O'Donnell, yeah, you all know Chris O'Donnell returned back as Robin for this one. And that was about it. Uma Thurman was basically a. 66 Batman's villain, basically, just in the modern time. Yeah, movie sucks. I hate. I I despise the film, but of course it came with the pack, four pack of the Blu-ray four pack that I have. I don't really watch on the regular. Can't stand it. I love Arnold as an action hero, but Mr. Freeze, no. Mm -mm. No. 
that move, this movie sucks. I can't stand it. Don't watch that film, please. For the name, for all things that is great with Batman, do not. I repeat, do not watch Batman and Robin. Well, that's my review for Batman and Robin. Thank y'all for watching. Please like, subscribe, and share, and also comment. Um. Well, next on the list, thank God we're going back to a good film. We got Batman Begins. This film on Pat signing off. Always three things. Always, I when I sign off, three things always. Need peace. Need love. Need blue. Catch y'all later, guys. I love y'all. Peace.